Welcome to my channel, and these are five reasons why you should learn computer networking. China, what? Technically speaking, te te technically, technically, technically speaking, I ain't talking vegan when I said that I've been eating, making money on the side, but I use it for the main. So let's get into it. These are my five reasons why you should learn computer network. Computer networking is really just how computers talk to each other. So why not learn the basics and grow from there? Number one. Reason number one is learning computer networking first is the basics of like all IT. You know if you follow my journey and if you don't follow my journey, you can follow it at www.technicallyspeaking.com. Um, yes, I blog there about my journey as a network engineer and how I broke into tech and how I continue to increase my income through the use of tech. Basics, right? It's the basics of how computers talk to each other. And we use computers, right? Whether that's computer small in your hand or actually, you know, desktop computer. At the end of the day, you need to know the fundamental knowledge of how they communicate. Why not learn everything? That brings me to number two. The second reason is it exposes you to everything. Like a jack of all trades. Um, you can finish it, a master of none, but a jack nonetheless. And that nonetheless, and that gives you advantage of, again, everyone else who's sitting there not doing anything with their lives because we're all about increasing your income through tech over here on this channel. So why not not know a little bit of everything. Get your feet wet and, and a little bit secure. Wireless, a little bit of voice, right? Voice over IP. Data, a little bit of automation or programming. Get yourselves wet in some databases. See what's going on, see what you like, see what you don't like, and go from there, you know? And that builds me to number three, confidence. Once you're able to know a little bit of, of, of everything, a little overview of tech, you can speak to it. You can speak to things that you weren't able to speak to. And that gives you confidence to go out there and either learn another sector. So that leads me to four. You're able to um, talk that talk and get into doors that you normally wouldn't be able to to get into um you're opening doors to grip money again over here we're all about increasing our income through tech so uh four is all about having a good salary it's learning how computers can operate can get you into making more money than what you have been making increase your income through tech that's what we are about so number five my last one is it makes you a badass like at the end of the day, having this knowledge, upping your game and can say, oh, about UT I know the difference between UDP and TCP, All right? Like I know type of ports that we need to open. I understand opening and closing ports for certain type of reasons. When you can kind of talk to that on a, on a, just a conversational level, then, you know, it just creates you to be the badass in the room, to be in the room to where, you know, folks want to talk to you and pick your brain. And even if they are on the level it's just you can just keep going over and over because there's so much to talk about. Computer networking, uh, it's something you can just choose a topic. What do you want to talk about? You want to talk about wireless communication? Uh, you want to talk about databases? What, Cisco, Juniper, Avaya? What, you, what do you want to talk about? What do you want to do? You know, I'm just throwing out words out here just to say like, hey, if you know what I'm saying, then we can have a conversation, right? And the people who don't know what I'm saying is like, hmm? So that makes me a badass because I know another language. <laughs> that is my take on why you should learn computer networking first before anything else as a new. Um, tell me what you think. If you guys have a topic you want to talk about, let me know in the comments as well. Now, side note. Um, like I said, I am a network engineer. Uh, specifically, I am a Cisco network engineer.